Hello, welcome to the Grouping and Mapping course. My name is Nathan Elrod. To start, let me define what a digital twin is. Don't worry, I'll keep this brief. An iTwin is a collection of data. It gathers all the data into one place, no matter what the source is. It provides us a single window to the project. Here at the iTwin platform, all sources are treated equally. Although they are treated equally, they still have differences. And these differences affect how you, as a developer, can interact with the data, especially when it comes to querying information within the model. It'd be very convenient if we just had a way to group the elements together and map properties from them. But this is where grouping and mapping helps. Grouping and mapping provides a way for users to tell us developers what data they need from our applications. Just like those data sources, the window to the project may not be one size fits all. Everyone wants something different. Grouping and mapping allows us to create a window specialized for our viewer. During this course, we'll follow the journey of two engineers who want specialized views for their own purposes. They'll each get their own window. We are going to show you how you can create custom applications, harnessing the grouping and mapping API that empower users like our engineers to make the most of their digital twins.